kind of the young guys are learning. Are you taking yoga? No. Good. What kind of, how do you, as a man, who are you going to beat up if you're good at yoga, you know? Hey, back off or I'll stretch. <laughs> picture myself in a relaxed setting. <laughs> You'll show them. You'll I know, show right? I want to hear about your yoga skills. How often you go. His energetic physical humor has made our first guest a favorite on the Bob and Tom show and late night across the board. But better than all of that, comedian Greg Hahn joins us on the blend before his hey! stand-up shows. <laughs> Thanks for having me back, everybody. <laughs> I know. So Come on, why am I wearing such a dark shirt in that clip? I'm, I look, I'm frowning, dark shirt. Come on, we're having a good time. Uh... It's Friday. You know me, I drink shampoo. I was, I was born eight and a half months early. Give me a hand, everybody. Comedy's not my thing. Come on, let's party. Tampa, I love it. Come on. Okay. Carly, Carly. I got to find a hot blonde tonight. Or brunette, or redhead. Some girl with hair. Or a nice hat. Okay. A hat. A hat. You've expanded. So that's like why we joke. Is, are we, did we let Greg back in, or was he willing to come no, back no, in? No, no, I came through the, the window. Question. I'm not this even on the schedule. This is what we remember about you last time. Is I, yeah. like, I, I mean, it's a little loud in here when you're here, but that's what I've you got to get used to. I've got volume control issues. I should learn <laughs> what it's like to have a conversation. Is this how you were when you were a kid? Like, yeah. I would no, love I to shy. see you. I think I was quiet. No, you were not. No, you were not. Yeah, I think I was kind of quiet. There. There. There I was brought up in Florida. I was brought Are up in Florida. Really? I love Florida. But you know what? Can I? I have a thank you for you, actually. I don't okay. know if you if you're aware of this, but talking about being loud, my director and I were having some fun today because you are loud. This is like the only day of the year where I'm not the loudest person on set. Are you so loud? thank you. All right, okay. Thank you, Greg. High thank five. you for making me not the loudest person in the room. Come on, that's how I do it normally. Love it. Love All it, right. Greg. We're in the loud Beep. people's Party world. Party horn. Yes. All right. So, so since last time, you're, you're still looking for a wife. i got to find a wife, man. In the yoga okay. studio, it sounded like That's you were a good you place to meet. That would be good. Time. I get down on one knee. When I date a girl, I get down on one knee if I want to get engaged or if I want to break up. She has no idea which way we're going. Mm. We're all uh. pins and, just all of a sudden I'm down. Will you make me the happiest man in the world and let me out of this debacle? Come on, everybody. Uh. Do <laughs> That was a good joke. Well, say, that was a good joke. I feel bad for the ladies. I guess I that's know. where our sympathy goes when you're breaking up with them. No, they don't care. They love it. You ever notice uh, sometimes, what was I going to say? Oh, what do you do when you get a, a wedding invitation? First, check the box, will not attend. Then go down and make your food choice, but write in to go. Come on. Uh. These are jokes. These are good. <laughs> I was dating this one girl. She's like, why is it every time I try to talk about our relationship, you always insist on changing the topic? I said, you're absolutely correct. Your car does pull to the right. Come on, jokes, everybody. <laughs> Stick with me. Uh, jokes, jokes, everybody. Love it. Okay, jokes, everybody. Jokes, everybody. I'll answer your question. Hey, let's go. What I remember from you last time, too, is you do a lot of corporate events, too. Yeah, what kind of corporate, corporate places are you going to? Anyway, like, I don't who? care. It's the same as the club act, but I wear a suit. Okay. And I clean you it just up. Just dress it up a little bit. Yeah, I look at their website. I might study their competition. I might make fun of their competition. Okay, oh, that's smart. You know, but uh, corporate shows, are, they're a good time. They pay well. And you're saying the comedy, the, the comedy scene. Well, okay, let's speak of paywall. That's actually going to make me change where I was going to go with that. One thing I love about your bio, you say right. you had a nice corporate job, but who wants to make what you could make, you know, in the course of a week? When well, you I should make have it a like job that pays $200 year. a day when I could be a comedian and make that in a week. I love that. That was the I love joke. That. See? Yeah, yeah. Comedy's great. Some people do comedy for the art. Some people do it for the money. I do it for the money. Okay. okay. The money. There you nice. go. No, no, well, no. you said it this weekend. You got lots of shows coming up. Yeah, I got like 8,000 shows at Side Splitters. That pay what? 50 cents a piece. Yeah. <laughs> but it's so fun. This place is bananas. This yeah. is real. Uh, this is a real comedy club. I started this place. Aww. Actually, yeah. You said you're from South Florida, so there yeah. you go. Well, yep. they're local, right? There's the website to get your tickets. Go in for a few that laughs. Is. There that it is. is. Come Thanks on in, everybody. We're going in. bananas. <laughs> going Whether bananas. you're in school, going to college, out of school, have a job in the military. Come on in. We'll do jokes about all of it. I like Sounds it. Sounds good. Come Thanks, on. Thanks, Thanks for having me back, ladies. <laughs> all right. Stay with us. We'll be right back. <laughs>